Welcome back to Electric TV. As always, I'm your host, Dominic Giratano. On this program, we highlight the very best in electrical construction, complex projects built by the Powering America team of NECA and the IBEW. Nicknamed Data Center Alley, Loudoun County, Virginia is home to one of the most active and vibrant collections of data centers in the world. And with the demand for more data at a faster rate, it's the perfect location for a critical look at what's being done to keep pace. With its picturesque towns and rolling hills, Loudoun County, Virginia might be the last place you would expect to find the historic technology boom. One of the original internet communication nodes was located just about five miles away and a bunch of the major early internet leaders and communication companies. Uh, because of that proximity, everybody started to come here and it's just grown into a huge uh, market and concentration of internet services. But with consumers seemingly insatiable thirst for digital content, industry-leading co-location companies like Cyrus One are expanding as quickly as possible to meet customer demands with the construction of additional cutting-edge data center facilities all built in record time. The internet is growing so fast that our customer is asking how fast can you get us in and we've optimized our system to be able to build these large-scale projects, hyperscale. Cyrus One's latest hyperscale construction project is currently being built in Sterling, Virginia. Our first project was on the other side of the building. It was Goliath, 220,000 square feet, a little over 20 megawatts in about six months. This project we call David, because it's about half the size, about 120,000 square feet, and a little over 10 megawatts, also in about six months. Both of them are some of the fastest builds in the data center industry. For Cyrus One's aggressive growth strategy to work, an electrical contractor and a labor force with the experience, skill, and expertise are must-haves. And Cyrus One has found that partner with the NECA IBEW team of Rosenden Electric and IBEW Local 26. We uh, are solutions-oriented contractor, right? So every, uh, I think every challenge that they put in front of us, we try to figure out a way to actually solve the problem for them. Rosen as a whole, we have people who are dedicated to data center construction across the board. We have PMs, we have execs, we have superintendents, we have formal, we have sub foreman, and we have a, a very large group of electricians that we carry or attempt to carry from job to job to maintain consistency on the craftsmanship and safety and, and expectation levels. Schedules for projects like this are usually measured in months, but Cyrus One's Sterling project is measured in hours. You're building a full-blown data center, which from my experience, everything I've done before in the past, you would have six months, eight months to a year to do. And it was a smaller scale. So you took everything that you've done before and just not only cut it in half, you know, you, you break it down to maybe a third of the time that you may have had before. Meeting an aggressive schedule is demanding on all the trades, but Cyrus One's unique dependency on electricity puts an additional emphasis on the technicians and electricians themselves without diversion to their exacting specifications. We need the critical power to run all the servers that are basically running the internet. When we're looking at critical power, tradecraft is ultimately important to us, right? Because tradecraft equals quality. That's why we turn to top-notch uh, electrical contractors like Rosenin, and we look for them to get top-notch trade uh, providers from Local 26. Quality and craftsmanship that go into a job of this magnitude uh, are unprecedented. I mean, the amount of work that goes into trying to put a job together in two months, if you don't get it right the first time, which involves a high level of workmanship and a high level of craftsmanship and a high level of self-quality control, you don't have time to do rework. Schedules are one thing, tight schedules are another. Safely working under these conditions is yet another. Well, it's fast-paced, it's so fast-paced that we have to be extremely aware of the, of the safety concerns. On a job of this magnitude and this schedule, to really focus on safety and make sure the guys are working safely, make sure the guys are well-rested, make sure that you know, the adequate breaks are taken, that they, they're not overworking themselves. The Goliath project was completed in record time, but David is posed to shatter even those records. 
for Project David, everything's going great. The, um, the staff out there uh, is really taking advantage of some of the lessons learned from the first building and Goliath. We're very appreciative of having contractors and um, electricians who are dedicated to our purpose because we're asking them to work around the clock on really some of the most complex electrical systems in the industry and we're asking them to deliver these in record time. With the demand for data centers still on the rise, the NECA IBEW team will be there every step of the way to meet that demand. That's it for this edition. Be sure to check us out on Facebook and Twitter for behind the scenes extras and industry information. Until next time, I'm Dominic Giratano. So long.